YouTube, what's up? This is Mech from Mech Tech Gaming, and this right here, all that pixelation and distortion, I'm sure you can clearly see that. That is what I was um, encountering in um, my latest video, and I thought that I really need to investigate what the cause was and uh, how to fix it. All this pixelation and distortion in the video and audio is obviously just unacceptable. So, I did a bit of research on uh, YouTube and the Roxio forms, and pretty much what I came up with was you need to be able to meet all the requirements. Now, my computer can, but you need to have at least a uh, 2 gigahertz dual core processor and make sure that your uh, laptop or PC is not overheating. Um, I don't have that problem. I have plenty of ventilation. I don't have any dust in my computer. I have a 3.4 gigahertz uh, quad core processor. I have uh, 16 gigabytes of RAM and I have um, at least a gig of dedicated graphics memory. So that's not the problem. Problem is I need to fiddle with my uh, Nvidia graphics card settings. Um, and if you don't have NVIDIA, then this video is not for you. I will post a link in the uh, video's description showing a uh, solution for you, for people that are using an ATI graphics card. So to uh, get to the spot you need to be, you need to go to your NVIDIA uh, control panel. So that you can get to there simply by right clicking and going to NVIDIA control panel. Or if you go to start, control panel. Hardware and sound, and there it is right there. So in here, um, what I found is you have uh, under 3D settings, go to manage 3D settings, and in the global settings, you need to uh, put them all as I have here. Um, I kind of had to play with it a little bit, um, but this is what I came up with. And if you want to just um, pause the video and uh, just copy down what I have here. I'll give you a couple seconds to give you a chance to do that. And then I'll scroll down. Okay, so now I'll scroll down to the other part you can't see and use those settings as you see them here. This might not work for everybody, but it worked for me, so this is why I'm sharing it with you. So after I uh, set up these settings, I went ahead and I did some testing. I did a uh, five minute uh, record on a game and then I did another five minute record while uh, recording myself uh, with a webcam because sometimes you want to do uh, recording with a webcam while you play you know if you do a let's play and you want to have your reaction on the screen at the same time well that's what you do and not everybody has uh, two computers where you can record yourself with a webcam on one computer and record your gameplay with the other one, you know, some people just can't do that. So it'd be great if this would actually work for you. And uh, this is what I did. So uh, I'll show you the uh, test results right now. So as you guys can see, uh, it looks fine. Um, those are short clips, but trust me, they were longer. I just had to trim it down for the sake of the uh, length of the video, but they look fine. I had no uh, video glitches or audio glitches at all. And uh, believe it or not, in my uh, other videos, I would usually get a little bit of uh, glitching here and there, but it was flawless since I uh, applied those settings. So. Um, like I said before, this might not work for everybody, but you can at least try and uh, maybe experiment a little, see what might work for you. Um, if, if you have any questions, uh, feel free to leave them in the comments. 
So as long as uh, all your cables for your Roxio are um, in good shape and the Roxio is not uh, faulty and you've uh, ran all your uh, virus scanning devices and all your drivers are updated, the Roxio software is updated and all that stuff, all the usual things you should already know. Uh, as long as all that's done and you uh, try my settings and fiddle around with them, then uh, this might work for you. So I hope this helped and uh, this is Mech from Mech Tech Gaming. I'll see you guys later.